Welcome back to another video wherever you are special greetings to you and don't forget if today is your first time I be you know that please do me a favor by subscribing to the channel also don't forget to hit on the notification bell whenever we drop video you can also get it and watch on this channel we give you information and update about migrants and also the latest update around the globe you subscribe to this channel because you need important and useful update and as official cracker it is my duty and responsibility to give you all the necessary and the importance updates that you need. That is why I have come to your way once again with this video. But in this video, we are going to be talking about how Italians are criticizing the interior minister who is Luciana Lamorgese for disembarking 800 migrants recently. And finally, we are also going to be talking about the Italian citizenship wala to migrants children or migrants who have given birth to their children in the countryside so guys so guys without wasting much time let's do this thing together yeah as i said before you know recently italy has disembarked 800 migrants who were waiting in the ocean viking rescue and also the sea watch for a long time on top of the mediterranean sea because italy was waiting to see whether some of the eu countries will come to their aid so that they will share these migrants but none of the eu countries came to their aid so they decided to i mean luciana lamorgese that is the interior minister decided to allow the ocean viking and the sea watch today to drop these 800 migrants on the lands of italy and this is where the citizens of Italy and Matteo Salvini together with Giorgia Meloni, they are complaining that Luciana Lamorgese has committed a big crime for, I mean, allowing these 800 migrants to be disembarked in the country. But without wasting much time, I just want to read something about what carried the whole issue came about how the Italians are criticizing this woman for what she did. And then the disembarkation of these migrants has brought another problem of the Italian citizenship. Now, you know, there are a lot of athletes in the Italian uh, squad, but some of them are not citizens of Italy because they were born by migrants. <laughs> Guys, Italy people, because they were born by migrants, they are not citizens. Unless you are 18. And then that 18, it's not that you the time you get 18 years, you will go and then they will put it in your hand, collect your citizen and go. It has to take time, some years before they will even give you the citizenship. But this is where the Olympic Committee, they said there is one chief over there, the chief of this uh, Italian Olympic Committee, because, you know, the recently game, the recently Olympics tournaments that went on, there were a lot of migrants who won the medals for Italy, but out there they see them as Italians, but when they come to the country, they don't see them as Italians. They eat pasta, they drink vino, some of them even eat pasta more than Italians. Some of them even drink vino more than Italians. They feel the inside their blood that they are Italians. But Italy people or the citizens of the country don't see them that they are, the, they are citizens of the country. This is where the chief of this Italy Olympic, Olympic tournament, is Olympic, uh, Italy Olympics, is saying that now... The migrants that they are, they are performing in this kind of thing for the country, they go out to present the country, but yet they are not citizens of the country. So they are asking the interior minister to do something about it. But the interior minister want to do something about it. But will Matteo Salvini allow the interior minister to do something about it? Let me just read what I have here from Info Migrants and then we will talk more about this Italian citizenship and also the 800 migrants that is bringing a big problem in the country. Now, they said it is debates over birthright citizenship reform following Olympics. They said in Italy, the Olympic Committee chief has sparked a renewed debate over citizenship law by demanding reforms to young the athletes born to foreign parents can compete for Italy. Interior Minister Luciana Lamorgese has indicated that she is open to discuss usually birthright citizenship for athletes and others, drawing criticisms from Matteo Salvini. Interior Minister Luciana Lamorgese on Monday expressed willingness 
to discuss a proposal made by the Italian Olympic Committee, that is the CONI, Chief Giovanni Malago, to speed up the bureaucratic process to get the citizenship for athletes born in Italy to non-nationals. Under Italy's current citizenship law, people born in Italy to non Italian parents have to wait until they are 18 to apply to get the Italian citizenship. The policy has long been controversial with, with advocacy groups and UNICEF pushing for a change to uh, a U solely that is a birthright citizenship system under which people born in Italy are automatically citizens. <laughs> Italy, Italy should allow you if they just give birth to you automatically you become citizens. <laughs> They will tell you that it is not going to work in their country. Let's move forward. They said, many successful athletes not born as citizens. They said, Giovanni Malago argued that Italy loses out on athletic talent because young people born in Italy to migrant parents can compete for their country, not only to to not only to they have to wait until they are 18 to apply to to apply to become italian citizens they then also face a bureaucratic process that can take months and years to compete to complete italy recently placed 10th in the medal count at the tokyo olympics with a record number of 40 medals 10 goals 10 silver and 20 bronze News site European News Euro, Euro News reported that uh, 46 of Italian athletes who competed in the recent of Olympics are foreign-born, according to Italy Olympic Committee. This includes medal winners such as U.S.-born Lamont Marcel Jacobs, who won to who won two gold medals as a runner in the men's uh, 100 meters event and weights 4x4 meter team event. They said Salvini against you solely reforms. My uncle, why is it that any good thing that is coming to migrants or immigrants in the country, you decide to come against it? Are you, are you enemy of progress? Now, they said, Lamoregese said that citizenship law was an issue that is important and that Italy should ensure that second generation immigrants feel like an integra integral part our so of our society, not only when our athletes win medals. Matteo Salvini, the leader of the far right league party, criticized Lamorgese's statement, saying that instead of speaking uselessly about you solely reform, the interior minister should control who enters Italy illegally. Now, they said critics accused Salvini of hypocrisy, exploiting issue. Enrico Letta, the secretary of the Letta, the secretary of the center left Democratic Party PD responded saying that the issue of citizenship reform had nothing to do with security or migrant management. Those who exploit the issue of usually citizenship reform are simply refusing to look at the reality. He said citizenship law reform has to do with equality, integration and the vitality of a society that has changed despite the fact factious interpretation made by populists. They said the co spokesman of the Europa Verde Party, Angelo Bonelli, praised Interior Minister Lamorgese, saying that this youth born to foreigners in Italy should feel like an integral part of our society. It is paradoxical that Salvini is speaking about this while celebrating the Olympic medals won by the athletes that were not born in Italy. They said government divided over citizenship. They said, meanwhile, the undersecretary of the interior minister, uh, League Party member Nicola Molteni, criticized the proposal by Connie Chief. Citizenship is a status, not a right. The law on citizenship should not be changed. He said he claimed that you solely will never pass because the League Party will make sure of this. Forza Italia, member of the parliament, Deborah Bergamini, said that more than, more than trying to introduce new reforms of usually that is needed 
is to make the current system work better she added in any case great job to uh, chairman malago and all italian athletes for this italian record uh, setting year so as i said before matteo salvini is against this thing but he posted uh, the people who won this medals for the country but for them giving them uh, citizenship this man is saying uh, Luciana Lamorgi is to stop the useless speaking that she's speaking that she wants to give the, uh, citizenship to migrants who are who have given birth to their children in the country but if you are looking at the scenario it shouldn't have been something difficult for migrants who are born in the country because you feel at home you in your blood you feel everything that you are Italian but they don't see you if you go outside to perform they see you as Italian but if you come to the country they side they don't see you as Italian as I continue to always say that Luciana Lamorgese have something good or have good plans for migrants but the only problem here is people who are back uh, trying to I mean frustrate this woman because this woman i am praying that this woman shouldn't resign because this woman is someone that she doesn't talk she doesn't come out and say migrants this migrant that migrants that but maybe you know italian uh let's say they this european uh politicians they don't care if they are in a position that you are attacking them too much they will just wake up one day and they will say they will not do again because if they leave that one they will get another job it's not like this our african leaders if something is going to happen they will tell you that uh, i will still be in the position but we are praying that luciana lamorese shouldn't resign she should continue helping migrants the way she is trying to do so now they are still she's still on that to see whether they can help this usually children who are born here so that they can make the process very fast for them so that they can also be citizens in the country so guys this is the update i have today for you and if you are new here say the devil is a liar subscribe to the channel and be part of the family you can follow me on instagram official underscore cracker one i'll be leaving in the youtube video description youtube it is official cracker on facebook it is still official cracker till we meet again in the next video please stay safe and stay blessed peace out